2018, the Reds made it clear that they see Green's future as a pitcher. In his first game of the season, it was clear why the Reds made that choice. Green struck out eight hitters and walked none over three innings of work. Well, we have tape of his debut, and we sat Pedro Martinez and Ron Darling down in our tape room to break it down. How about Bryce Harper out of the gates? The man is from the Pirates that set Baez straight. It was his own teammates. After the game, Baez said, you know what I really got out of today? You know what I learned? How ugly I looked on that fly ball. A lot of teammates came up to me and they said it in a nice way. You learn from it. So could Baez bounce back on Thursday and continue his hot hitting? has outpaced his hitting a bit early in the season. But everyone who has played Mario Kart knows that you are always one gold star away from being back in the front of the pack. For Ramirez, that gold star has come in the form of the Tigers. He is hitting almost 500 against Detroit with 10 home runs since 2017, including one on Tuesday. So could Ramirez and the Indians power up against those Tigers on Thursday? Hutchin had five tools on the field, but who knew he was also a talented impressionist off the field? That was McCutcheon doing an impression of Cleveland from Family Guy and the Cleveland Show to the actual character's voice actor, Mike Henry. For McCutcheon and the Giants, the early part of the season has been an exercise in treading water as they navigate around three-fifths of their starting rotation being on the disabled list. Thursday, Chris Stratton and his 79 career innings pitched takes his turn in the rotation as the Giants clash with the Padres for the first time this year. Rod Carew and Kirby Puckett as the only players to collect 2,000 hits in a Twins uniform. Maurer, whose OPS has increased in each of his last three seasons, is playing his best baseball since his MVP season back in 2009. He enters Thursday second in baseball in on-base percentage and fourth in batting average. Of course, for the always modest Maurer, the milestone is just another number. He said it's been fun to see some of the fans come out and make signs and hold up the Maurer meters. For for me, it's just been about trying to have good at-bats and help our ball club win. So could Maurer hit his way to 2,000 on Thursday?